Bayhawks lead is cut to two. Here's Atkins between the circles, takes it right side. Now to Edgem, he'll try a straight on three pointer and he hits it. So a quick answer, jumped out to a 13 to five lead as here's Atkins left side for Erie, kicks it to Cabongo, right side, three pointer and they hit again. Bayhawks lead is 16 to five. We have 7.50 to go here in the first quarter. Seibert straight on three pointer and he hits. Five for five to start the game. Now right side, it's Edgem driving under the bucket, kicks it to Atkins, great ball movement, Seibert for three, left side, he hits again. Unbelievable. Six for six from beyond the arc to start the game. They lead it 22 to five. We might have to have jam two timeouts in the final three minutes of this quarter because another one I don't think counted as one as Seibert hits a three from the left side. See that score, uh, that school scores on the bottom of the screen recently. Here's an alley-oop. Uh, Atkins to Davis. Davis caught it. Couldn't get the alley-oop part of it, but then he laid it in. Here's it now, baseball style, up to Cabongo, and they rotated quickly to Atkins in the right corner. Egwu now right side, 15-footer hits. Anna Egwu has four of his six points here in the third quarter, and there's a steal. Harvey takes it away near midcourt, sends it to Atkins, who goes bursting into the lane, kicks it left corner. Cabongo, open three, and he hits. Top to Atkins. Actually, they're in a zone. That's why that's a weird mismatch. Here's Davis, right baseline from 15. Got it. 